Hey, this is John Johnson reviewing the book, uh, the first book of Adam and Eve by Rutherford, I think, P. Hayes. Overall, this was a good book in my opinion. I was I was highly impressed um, with the consistency of the characters uh, from the ones that I've read in the Bible. Um, I, I love the power of repentance, uh, just being able to know when you mess up and just, you know, really digging down deep and asking for sincere uh, forgiveness. It happens a lot. And I read some comments about the book and some people get annoyed uh, trying to make fun of Adam in the book, uh, saying that he's not this big, strong, powerful guy. But if you read the Bible, it, God's not God's not out there pushing the big, strong, powerful ones. He's, he's, he wants the ones that have the heart of repentance, the heart of, uh, of uh, you know, uh, the meek hearts, those types of things. So overall, good book. It can be a potentially sad book, but I love the fight uh, for justice that you see. Um, just because I know a lot of people in the Christian space, they try to play the nice, nice game. You know, I'll just be as nice as possible and I'll be able to, you know, be a good person. But when it comes down to it, you gotta be able to know the ways that evil is gonna try to trick you. Uh, whether it's, you know, in this book, it's considered Satan. Whether it's in real life, it could be some employee, employer of yours or, or a coworker of yours, or it could be, you know, the next door neighbor. You gotta know how people are trying to come after you because here on earth, that's just how it works. So overall, good book. I recommend it for anyone um, who's trying to uh, grow themselves, humble themselves, uh, and just have a, a more keen eye towards trickery. Have a great day.